All right, all right. LD MMAC. This is your boy, Coach Shelton Harris, and you're live, live, live on the Coach Shelton Harris and Combat Sports Show Live. Now, some of you that, if you're, you know, if you normally, you know, look at my channel for boxing videos, now, you're probably looking at, you know, you're probably thinking to yourself, who is this silly bastard on the screen? Who is this silly looking bastard on the screen? You know, uh, this is Kobe Queefington, or Covington, sorry, okay? Now, you know, I have not seen a lot of videos on this. And, and you know the coach, I don't really keep up with the men in, 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 in MMA, but, but, but you know, folks, I got to, you know, I got to ask this question. Because so many people dogged out Amanda Nunes. But Kobe Covington had a sinus infection. Now, I mean, since y'all said, and y'all, I said all the Nunez detractors, you people said that Nunez ducked a fade. So by this same logic, did Kobe Covington duck a fade? I mean, you know, it, it just sounds kind of funny. And I know I'm late to the party on this because I don't follow men's MMA like that. But God dog it, you guys should have known that I was going to make me a video on this popcorn pop tart fart. Hot almighty. Man, a sinus infection, huh, Kobe? Well, <laughs> oh, man, man. I, I tell you, boy, this just gets better and better. How did I not know about this one? I mean, so a sinus infection kept you from, you know, had giving your opportunity. You gave your opportunity away to Darren Till, by the way. Okay? And now you may not even get a shot at Tyron Willie. You may have to beat somebody else before you even get Tyron Willie now. Wow, Kobe. But I will say, at least you didn't do like Amanda did. At least you didn't do like she did and wait till what? Almost fight night to pretty much say, hey, you know what? I got to count. So I'm going to give you that one, Kobe. I'll give you that. But I wonder why. I wonder why, Kobe, you know, I don't believe it was a sinus infection. I don't believe that. No, not this guy. Not Mr. I'm going to put the belt on Donald Trump's desk. No, not this guy. Of course not. A sinus infection not going to stop him. This is Kobe Covington, right? This is the man with the Gomer Powell haircut. It looks like somebody cut his hair with a butter knife. Kobe Covington is a tough guy. He's tougher than some sinus infection. Wow. How is he going to explain this one? Is anybody really riding Kobe Covington right now? Is anybody on his, on, on his helmet? It's not a lot of people on this guy's helmet. You know, I think I need to be on this guy's helmet. Kobe, what really was the reason you didn't take this fight? I mean, I, I, I mean can, you, can, can anybody in the comment section say it? Now, I know we're going to have these, you know, I know we're going to have the defenders and we're going to have the Kobe Covington fanboys. I know that you're going to come to the comment thread and, you know, it's good because I know you guys are going to see the title of the video and you're going to be too stupid not to watch the video. I know you are. Now, I'm not talking about Kobe Covington fans. I'm talking about Covington fanboys. Now, there's a difference. And you guys, you'll be the guy that you'll watch the video from start to finish. You'll, you, you'll listen to every single word. And you will leave a soliloquy. You'll leave a dissertation in my comment thread. And sometimes I just like making you guys mad. You know, I like the guy that'll leave like 10 comments. And then when he realizes they're not showing up, he get pissed off. Why well, the comments not showing up, man? <laughs> <laughs> it's called troll torture it's called my way of torturing trolls it's quite fun actually it's quite fun you know maybe i got to show you guys one time man like when you get these guys that, that's trying to leave a comment and then you know they when they realize their comments ain't showing up and then they leave about five thousand of them and then they be pissed off man i, I be <laughs> i laugh at that it's fun it's like the first three times you didn't realize that your comment's not showing up. Wow. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. So Kobe Covington, 
got out of his fade, didn't he? And I know you guys, man, he always said duck and fade. He, he does his new thing now, duck and a fade. That's right, duck the fade. He ducked the fade. I mean, now he ducked the fade before the fight happened, which, you know, I guess fight fans can appreciate that. And Amanda Nunes ducked the fade right on the night of the fight. Fight fans will not appreciate that. But you got to wonder, all the junk that Kobe Covington was talking, he was going to do this to Woodley. He made Tyron Woodley cry in practice. Man, this is his moment of glory. You know, I'm sitting here thinking they said he got injured. I'm like, okay, he got injured. I'm thinking it's like a knee injury. I'm thinking it's like an Achilles heel. I'm thinking it's like ligament. I'm thinking it's his shoulder. I'm thinking it's a neck injury. I'm thinking it's something serious. A sinus infection. So he missed the biggest fight of his career for because of a sinus infection. Yeah. Seems like they've been talking to each other, him and Nunez. You know, Nunez probably is a sellout. You know, because why Nunez did not check this dude? And this is how you know. See, that's why now I see why the Brazilian people hate Amanda Nunez. This dude calling your people filthy animals. And you in the same gym. You, you're probably in there training with him. You see him. You talk to him. I think Amanda did defend this dude on one occasion, not for the comments that he made, but I think she did, you know, was talking about, you know, was helping him or, or saying something to him about his sinuses. I don't know. I think she said something about him in a positive light. And this man sitting running around here calling Brazilians filthy animal. And he, you are just as Brazilian as the day is blue. The sky is blue. You Brazilian. And you sitting around here and you and you friends with Kobe Covington. God almighty. That's why the Brazilian people don't like Amanda. That's why they can't stand it. Any Brazilian with some kahunas in that same gym, they would have ran up to him and checked him quickly. They would have checked him quickly. But we got to know that Amanda has long lost her Brazilian card. She done lost that. That Brazilian card been gone, okay? Amanda might well say she an American, man. Amanda is an American citizen. What you guys think, though, about that? I mean... Is he telling the truth? I think he's telling a bold-faced lie. You know darn well this dude ducked a fade. And that, my friends, well, that's just the way that is. It's just the way that is. And I'm going to stay on his neck, too. I'm done.